for story time. What is it, Grandma? I want to tell you what a heroic deed I did in the past that seemed to do so much work and misery. Is the story only about you? No, there are many heroes in the story. It went, it goes like this. A long, long time ago, Yaffa Bob Abraham is guilty. Rivka but Abraham is guilty. Here under the day tree, Devorah judges the people of Israel. Some people call Devorah the woman of thorns. Because whenever she met up with people, that she inspired them to do mitzvah. Devorah also put the, the wicks in the menorah and took much pride in the work. What? I'm not guilty. I promise you I'm innocent. We're, we're sorry, but Yafa's story was more believable than yours, and the facts were in her favor. You both have the right to make sorry. Yafa Bakgad is, is deemed innocent. Oh, thank you so much. There are also two reasons why the warrior judge is outside. One was because she wanted to admire all of God's creation. And the other was because she was not allowed to be in a room with a closed door alone longer than three minutes with a male. That is, just in case she was judging a male. She also was a prophet. That means God sends her messages and prophecies. In this particular case, it was a prophecy. Laura, the time has come for Yavin and Sisra to fall. A man named Barak ben Abinor, building 10,000 men to Mount Tabor. There, Yavin's empire will fall. Messenger! Rock Ben Avinu home for me? I'm not sure. Has he been very busy lately? That was a rhetorical question. Oh, then certainly, miss. Yes. Whoops! You called for me, Devoto? Yes. Hashem, Hashem said that you have to be, that you have to be 10,000 men, 10,000 men from God, from Naftali and Zvulon to Mount Tabor to fight this one. In te lefe i me, v'ha lachti in lo te lefe i me, v'loyola. I will only go if you come with me. If I come with you, I'm a woman that is not me, we'll get all the credit for the city of Sisa Mountain. Okay. Very well. I think we are very lucky to find land like this. I agree, and we love it here too. I must admit, I have my doubt, but Mount Tabor is the best place to live. Yes. They are training an army on Mount Tabor. And destroy them at all costs. Yes! This is it. All of Sisu's 900 chariots are down right there. Three, two, one. Let's roll. Okay, man, let's give this all we have. Go. Wait, what's that sound? It's the Jews! Sister has fallen asleep. Yael goes to the far corner of her tent, tent and takes 
takes it out of the pen, sticking it to the ground. She also takes a hammer. Then she hammers the pen into Sister's temple. That sounds good. I cannot believe I just. Excuse me? You didn't just say that. Kendall, that's how the story ends. Now can I tell you the story about Hanukkah? Yeah! Wow, give them a round of applause. That was some show. Let's hear it for um, Lira Rudinsky directing a beautiful job on the story of Devorah. And Baran. But stay tuned because we have Sir Rich Shares coming up right after this. She stole my robe! No, what are you talking about? This is my beautiful robe. Wait, no. I have a solution. How about you both share the robe? Oh, oh yeah! yeah. That's a good idea. Thank you. Thank you. For this man named Barack Ben Abinama. Go gather 10,000 men from the sons of Natali, from the sons of Zubulun, and hard to work so you can fight up against this trap, and I'll deliver him in your hand. Sure, sure, I will go with you, but the glory of winning the battle will not be yours, but a woman will get it. Okay. Oh, um, yes. Yes. This man, Barak, is coming with 1,000 people to do battle with us. So I'll gather 9,000 9, chariots that we will have, that we have. Actually, to be on, to be completely accurate, it's actually 900 chariots. But, don't worry about it. Barak, because they were going to conquer Sisra! Yeah. Here the brilliance of the director is clearly demonstrated by seeing how Shmuel just so perfectly acts out his role in that last scene. You got him! I should have told me you got him! Okay, bye. And he's okay! Wow, that's a really cool tent. This has been another edition of Novi Movie with the story of Barak and Dvora conquering Sisera and Yavin, directed by Sarichir. Till next time, have a great day.